students of a college in Coimbatore staged protest against their chairman and demanding his arrest. Now, this after students were enraged after two videos were circulated where the chairman could be seen harassing a woman staffer. Now, the woman who filed the police complaint initially later withdrew her complaint. Well, those visuals that you are seeing on your screens are of protests that was taking place uh, at a college in Coimbatore where students of this college uh, were protesting outside for the arrest of the chairman uh, who allegedly has uh, harassed women staff. Now, there were these two videos that were circulated and the videos enraged the students and they protested outside this particular college in Coimbatore in Tamil Nadu uh, demanding the arrest of the chairperson. But what is important here is to note how the woman who allegedly was harassed at the college uh, by the college chairperson first filed the complaint but later withdrew the entire complaint we'll try and uh, get some more details my colleague Pramod now joining me on the phone line with further updates Pramod we are seeing those visuals there of the Coimbatore college where the protest took place but help us understand the woman who filed the police complaint in this matter for allegedly being harassed by uh, the chairman why did she later withdraw her complaint well, certainly, as you mentioned, this issue has been going on for quite some time, and the uh, victim finally mustered her uh, uh, of courage to go forward to the police. But she apparently, we've been hearing through her uh, uh, colleagues that uh, she uh, needed some sort of evidence, and that's the reason there were a couple of videos of uh, uh, what this uh, particular chairman of his private college indulging in such uh, heinous activities. However, these videos went viral uh, last week, and what happened is that uh, uh, she also had gone ahead and filed a complaint. We spoke to the uh, Coimbatore uh, Corps, and they claimed okay. that the complaint was immediately retracted. We also put forward this question that since this being a workplace harassment, has the cops done any kind of suomo, taken any kind of suomo to action, or informed the state or national uh, commission for women? Uh, the cops stated that they haven't done anything so far, and they are waiting for some sort of complaint from someone. However, a special complaint has been filed with the CM cell by the Students Association and Teachers Association stating that this kind of activity cannot be accepted in such a manner and the cops are supposed to take so much action right now. So at this point, we're given to understand that uh, no suomoto action has been taken while a complaint has already been withdrawn. But this is also coming at a time where several lawmakers in Tamil Nadu have time and again raised the importance of uh, the Vishaka guidelines and also how it is important for the police to take note of workplace harassment as well. Well, it certainly is because, as you might know, the people over here, especially victims, um, come from a, a kind of a very poor background, or they need the support of these surroundings. And thus, Chairman Case in Point being one of the very influential okay. people, it is being stated by certain sources that there was a possibility that she became afraid later that she uh, that her uh, future could be spoiled in one way or the other, and that's the reason that like most of the victims uh, either do not uh, open up about the kind of atrocity they are going through, or uh, in their, in many cases uh, withdraw the complaint because they don't want any kind of uh, uh, future uh, problems or issues like that. But, uh, but however, as you mentioned, the cops are supposed to take some sort of action. Even you could see that the students have gone ahead and protested. Uh, thankfully, a couple of these, uh, uh, to, I mean, um, you know, teachers associations have filed a special complaint with the CM cell. We are waiting some kind of response from the CM right now. Okay. So we are waiting some kind of response. They're coming in from the chief minister as well. Many thanks, Pramod, for joining us with all those details.